This one is only for Gmail users, but you can actually use the indicator applet uh, to notify you if you have new email. Okay, so this is your indicator applet, and um, I'm gonna talk about two. So this first one is called the Gmail notifier, and the second one is called the GM notify. Basically, it does the same job, but uh, it'll display it a little bit differently. So the first one actually, you know, if you have a new email, it'll actually display the subject title. Uh, the second one, it doesn't display that. It only displays uh, the count uh, that you have in your inbox. Okay, that's new. So that's the difference. Um, and you can actually click on this uh, if you want to go to directly to it. This one it goes directly to uh, the the, the was it the mail that's in there. So if I click on it, uh, you see it goes directly to the mail. The other one, however, let me show you the other one. It just goes to the inbox. All right, so that's the difference. And to set this up, let me show you. So make sure you install it. But um, what was it the first one? Uh, the first one is called the Gmail Notify Settings. All you gotta do is type in your, you know, your um, Gmail account and password, and you can tell it, uh, you know, how many minutes do you want it to uh, refresh it. So there you go, and you just hit save. That's it. For this other one, uh, what was it called? Uh, the Gmail Notifier Configurations. There you go. This other one, he has like a little bit more options, but really, it's not that much. You just fill out your email address and. Um, I guess you can do some custom sounds also, but not really important. So that's it to set that up. You might want to, uh, what was it, go to your startup applications and add those in if you want to load it automatically. All right, it depends which one you use. But that's pretty much it, and I'll post a link on uh, the description box somewhere. So that's it for this one.